now I'm at Foodie yep. Games. <laughs> so it's doing some warm ups. Yeah, so this is warm up. So you activate your glutes. So <laughs> I like to do a little bit on like above the knees to start, going side to side or back on the sides <laughs> or putting it around the toes and then leaning slightly forward. So this is activating all side booty. Oh, I like this one. I've never done the toes. Oh my god, you haven't? No! It's so good! Toes are a new thing for me! Toes are so good. We can even do it in a handstand. Yeah. yeah. Have you ever done those? Yeah. Let's try them. Around the ankles. Okay. Alright. This isn't for everyone, you know, but if you're weird like us and are always upside down, you can do them in a handstand too. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you did it straight leg. Yeah. Oh, that's fun! Upside down bumper. I like this one. Oh, that's a new one. Ah! I'm wearing it as a belt now. <laughs> <laughs> or you can just like fall on the ground. <laughs> I'm laughing. That's how you get a butt. You just cut off all your circulation. <laughs> Come one day. Okay. Let's go, let's get those games. Oh, <laughs> when the band snaps. hora. <laughs> Let's get it. Okay. Get it. <laughs> yes. Okay, my shoulders are gonna die. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay. Those are hard. Let's go stability gains. <laughs> Let's get it. So good. So <laughs> it hurts good. so good. It hurts so good. All right, next up we have thrust. And I'm in. I was planning Hawaii. We're trying to book a flight to Hawaii while we're at the gym. <laughs> in between sets. <laughs> All right, so next set, we, our favorite is thrust. Got it. So we're putting, <laughs> yes. We're putting this box against the wall. It's and about this high. Yes. <laughs> about knee high. About knee high. <laughs> and we're going to be doing 45 on each side to start. With a band around our legs. Let's go. Yes. 
All pink everything. All pink everything. So while Mel is doing these, she's really focusing on getting that really good glute squeeze at the top, hitting that full range of motion at the bottom, and exploding with her hips. Glute thrusts are really good because it's a hip hinge motion instead of a knee hinging motion, so it really targets those glutes. And now she is adding in a whoop. I forgot what those are called, but a pulse, a, a pulse with like an extension of the knees to hit more of her outer glutes. So this way you hit the full glutes in this one workout. <laughs> All right, Britt is about to get it. I think I have to take my socks off. I know, I almost was sliding. <laughs> yes. She's holding at the top for like three seconds. You yes. can look attractive while doing this, good for you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Always making sure to stretch also in between sets. I like to put my toes backwards so I'm pulling and it's getting at my calves and the back of my legs. And then I pull my head to my toes. Smell and those feet, girl. I know. <laughs> oh my god, all the feet messages. <laughs> I know, she charges a million dollars a foot pick. <laughs> No, but we added on another 10 pounds, so now we got 65 pounds on each side. And it feels good. Feels great. Amazing. Yeah. And end with that stretch. Yes. Okay, our next favorite exercise is what's called um these are just a variation of kickbacks. These ones are lateral, so it hits more this way, and then you'll see once we get to the second one how it hits more back. Yes. <laughs> Alright, let's get this. So we just hook on this ankle thing to this line. They're at all the gyms. Now she's going backwards. A little bit heavier for backwards. Yes. So she's at 30 pounds. So it doesn't compromise the low back and it just activates the glutes. kickbacks to hit a different spot of her booty.
Let's get it. I like turn. I know I can turn. <laughs> Let's get it! 